Welcome to this week's edition of Matucci's at Home, cooking with Corey. This week we're going to be doing a Matucci's house bacon, caramelized onion, sauteed shrimp pasta with sun-dried tomato, artichokes, fresh basil, and white wine butter sauce. What I'm going to do is start off with a medium-high heat pan, saute pan. I'm going to add about an ounce of olive oil. And we're going to put our Matucci's house bacon with our yellow onions and we're going to get a nice crispness on it. While your bacon and onion is cooking, you're going to want to chiffon on your basil. And also cut up your butter. The... All right, now the bacon and onions are looking good. I'm going to turn up our heat a little bit and add in our shrimp. Do the shrimp for about two minutes and then we'll start adding the rest of our ingredients. Uh, in about two minutes, now we're going to add our sun dried tomatoes, artichokes. You can break the artichokes up a little bit if you like. And we're also going to add our garlic, and a little bit of salt and pepper. And we'll cook it for about another minute and a half and then we'll make our sauce. Next, we're gonna add our chili flake. And depending on your spice level, depends on how much you wanna add. I like mine a little bit spicy, so I'm gonna add a decent amount to it. And I'm gonna make sure your pan is very, very hot, so we're gonna deglaze it with white wine. And this is the, uh, release all those flavors from the bottom, all the love. Next, we're gonna add our lemon bursi. It's gonna help with the sauce, slow down the evaporation process. Add our fresh basil and our butter. We're gonna leave it on high heat just until the butter melts, and then we're gonna bring it down to a medium heat. So you don't wanna get it too high, it'll end up breaking your sauce. At this point, you want to make sure your pasta is warm. Almost there. Sweet. Now we're going to add our pasta. And this one, since the sauce is so hot, beautiful. Really, no need to rewarm the pasta. Is that a word? Now you're gonna want to take the house baguette and split it in half, and then take our butter. It's got garlic and parsley in it, and get a nice spread on there. You're gonna to want to make sure to pull your butter out and let it sit for about 20 minutes before you spread it on, so it's nice and soft and easily easily spreadable.